health. As many as 10% of people in the U.S. have been told or believe that they're allergic to penicillin. However, research shows the majority of those people are not actually allergic at all. Yeah, this is really interesting. On this Wellness Wednesday, Dr. McGeorge is here to explain why knowing the truth is so important to your health. This is something I hear often in the emergency room and medication allergies are serious, but sometimes a penicillin is actually the only or the very most effective antibiotic for a particular infection. So an incorrectly assumed allergy could deny someone the best treatment. Roughly 32 million Americans have it noted in their medical record that they are allergic to penicillin, but studies show more than 90% of those labeled as penicillin allergic can actually tolerate the antibiotic because they grew out of the allergy or it was misdiagnosed to begin with. So why do so many people incorrectly assume they're allergic? Well, first, many people who get an antibiotic to treat a bacterial infection might really have a virus. And viruses, especially in children, often cause rashes. So when the virus causes a rash, the antibiotic often gets blamed as an allergy. Also, antibiotics can cause side effects like nausea, vomiting, or some other symptom. While this might mean you're sensitive to the antibiotic, it's not an allergy. Correctly identifying a penicillin allergy is really important for several reasons. First, penicillins are great medications. They can be used to target very specific infections with a more precise focus, rather than using an overly broad non-penicillin alternative that's more likely to breed superbugs. Next, when someone reports a penicillin allergy, we often rule out using all the cillins, like amoxicillin or dicloxacillin, but also Many doctors avoid other antibiotics like Keflex. If you think you might have a penicillin allergy, it's a good idea to talk to your doctor about simple allergy testing to find out for sure. Now for people with well-documented penicillin allergies, if penicillin or a similar drug is the only choice, it is possible to desensitize someone so that they can use the medication. But generally, that's only done in critical situations. Back to you.